Muhammad Buhari has declared a state of emergency on Nigeria's water supply, sanitation and hygiene sector. The president made the declaration at the ceremony to inaugurate the National Action Plan for Revitalization of the Water Supply, Sanitation and Hygiene Sector at the State House Conference Center. Now, he has directed government at all levels to redouble efforts and work towards meeting the nation's water supply and sanitation needs. Tunjiriye has the rest of the story. In 2015, the United Nations noted that countries where open defecation is practiced are the same countries with the highest levels of poverty, wealth disparity, and under five child mortality. Presently, more than 50 million Nigerians still practice open defecations, and less than 60% Nigerians have access to clean potable water. Definitely, this is an emergency situation. Distinguished ladies and gentlemen, it is now my honor and privilege to launch the National Action Plan for revitalization of water supply, sanitation sector of our country. It is also my singular honor to formally declare a state of emergency on Nigeria's water supply, sanitation, and hygiene sector. Henceforth, Federal government support to state governments will be based on their commitment to implement the national water supply, sanitation, and action plan in their respective states and to end open defecation by 2025. 62 million Nigerians were yet to meet the MDG water supply indicators. This is the water supply situation. But if we go by the sustainable development target, which is uh, that we must have improved access to water supply located on premises, available when needed, and free from fecal and chemical contamination, we'll see that uh, 185 million Nigerians are off that target now, uh, at present. All available statistics from the Federal Ministry of Water Resources, Development Partners in Water and Sanitation, Experts all show that Nigeria needs an urgent solution to the challenges posed by lack and shortage of water to the vast majority of the population. So I congratulate you on behalf of the Development Partners Group, Mr. President, for playing such a critical role in moving us towards achieving this milestone. As we've heard, there are millions of children who are affected every single day by the situation of water, sanitation, and hygiene in, across Nigeria. Indeed, tens of thousands are dying under the age of five from diarrhea, which is entirely preventable. The action plan that has been launched by Mr. President today is not just a federal action plan. It is a national action plan, an action plan that was developed not only by federal government, but by state government's participation. Uh, just like you heard, it's an action plan that emanated from the system. Um, when we saw the statistics and we saw the problem that we had, you know, bearing in mind that the access to water supply sanitation is declining everywhere, it was taken to the National Council of Water Resources where a decision was made that we need to work together, the state and the federal government, local government, to develop a national action plan that will renew the partnership between federal, state, local government to collaborate, to work more, and also to put in development partners' efforts together towards increasing and improving access to water supply, sanitation and hygiene in Nigeria. There is a lot that needs to be done. We need to make sure that you know all the government, both from the federal government, the state and the local government, um, that everybody is on board. But not just that. We also need to have civil society, the media, you know, and, um, and, 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 and people at the grassroots level. I mean, if we, if we are in a war situation, the media will report what's happening every single day. That's the way we need to look at the situation with water and sanitation. It's a catastrophe. It's a crisis. You know, we only 34% of Nigerians have access to toilets. You know, um, a lot of us, over, over 100 million people are openly defecating. This is a crisis and I think that the government has done what it needs to do, you know, to declare a state of emergency and to make sure that everybody recognizes that all hands have to be on deck, including the media. With the former launch of water supply, sanitation and hygiene by President Muhammad Buhari, 
it is believed that more Nigerians will have access to portable water which will improve their standard of living. From the State House in Abuja, Sunji Oye, TV360 News.